Hi everybody, this is Kurt Hollowell with another tutorial on our audio visualizer tool. Today I'm going to be talking about the color change and material change scripts. So if you have the tool, you can follow along by going to audio visualizer and scenes and the city scene. And um, you can see all three of these buildings all have a color change script on it. And now let's go ahead and play and we can see what that looks like. So you can see here all three of these buildings are changing colors with the music. So let's go ahead and click this one. You can see uh, we have low and high color. That's basically when the audio data is low, we're going to be at this color. When the audio data is high, we'll be at this color. We have a lerp speed. That's how fast it changes between these colors. We have a sensitive sensitivity parameter. That's a multiplier onto the audio data that says um, how sensitive we are to it. And uh, we have a frequency range saying I want in this case I want to listen to the bass frequency range and um, the audio source. What audio source are we listening to on our audio sampler? In this case, we just have one audio source, so um, we're going to leave that to be zero. Um, so that's basically it. The color change script. It's going to listen to a specific audio source and range and um, lerp the material's color between the slow and high color. I'm going to hit play one more time. So you can see this one starts off as kind of like a brown and turns to green. This one uh, is between purple and blue, and this is between red and blue. Next, I want to talk about the material change script, and that's happening on these skyscrapers right here. You can see with the base notes, it's um, actually changing materials on these objects. So let's go ahead and look at that real quick. So if we look at this building blend material, it has you can put in two textures. In this case, I have uh, a blue city texture and then a, a dark city texture. And we can blend between the two. So you could do some pretty interesting stuff with this one. Um, this custom blend texture lit, this shader is um, included in the tool. And um, basically what the change material script is going to do is just move this blend parameter back and forth with the audio. Now you don't have to use this shader. If you want to use some other shaders, you can also alert between two materials. Um, let's go back to our... Uh, our material change script, here it is. Um, so you can see here, this has a blend texture, um, a blend material assigned to it, so we don't need to assign these low and high materials, but if you don't have this um, blend shader on your object, you'll have to provide two different materials in the low and high material. And then just like everything else, it has a sensitivity parameter, frequency range and audio source, just like the color change script, and a lerp speed. So that's it. I hope you can make some cool effects with this. And um, before we get off here, I'll just bring you to our website. This is doggydoggames.com. You can check out some games we're working on, um, some other tools, as well as get support for these tools. And um, here's the audio visualizer um, tool in the Unity Asset Store, if you don't have it yet. And um, that's it. Have a good one.